all right my people welcome back on to this channel well this is another strong one reaching out still on the matter well onto this one it six and i quote you must be detained isaac fire stops minister for passing one way in abuja all right my people the news in details well isaac fire the younger brother of the former Ikiti state governor Ayodele Fayoshi confronted a uh, serving federal minister for allegedly driving against traffic in Metama, Abuja. A video making the rounds online captures him ordering the yet to be identified minister to reverse his vehicle and then take the proper road. Well, onto this, he identified himself and then asked the divisional police officer on the road to do their jobs and then turn back the car driven by the government official. Well, onto this, sharing the clip on his Instagram page, Fireshe wrote, I had to stop a minister today for passing one way in Metama Abuja. No one is above the law. Thank you, Mr. Minister, for respecting yourself. He rained insults on the minister for flouting road rules and then wondered if the way he behaved is the type of country he wants as a seven member of government. All right, and then exactly what it is, if I share 77, your action is good for telling the person to go back but we don't tell people stupid when correcting please try and adjust that part thank you bro well um, b underscore j replacing well my name is isaac fire can you see the benefit of name can you can your family name did that i need to also more all right that's another one hmm police self no even no right and the wrong again well i am underscore mcnice you are really serving your country with all your strength all right well and my brother my sister this is exactly what is going on right now i think if everybody can come out in their numbers no i've said it times with that number for the country to be the way it is right now it is simply because everybody has not woken up on their rights and exactly what it is yes now that he has made his judgment right well as if i or she actually made that judgment right he knows his right he knows nobody is above the law yes if you can you know tell every other citizen that they should not flout one way while driving then who else should now do that that is to tell you that if we can follow suit if everybody can do the needful things will work out the way it's supposed to work i was you not know, telling some group of people some days ago that the way the country is right now if there is cooperation i am so very sure what we are suffering right now we will never suffer that look at what is going on look at uh, the situation of the country simply because some set of people are on the right part while some are on the left hand side nobody is ready to tell the truth simply because of you no know, peanuts that some of these people have actually gotten from maybe the people at uh, the post of authority and all that that's why they will tell you that na man no man which is not supposed to be how long are we going to continue like this how long are we going to you know call ourselves you know together we need to know that you know we have to do the needful for things to work out the way it's supposed to work to work out let's call a spade a spade and then uh, exactly what we are talking about look at what this uh, man has just portrayed you can imagine a, a serving minister you no know, plying one way and then what do you want to tell other citizens that oh you are better than them hmm. i like that word no, no one is above the law so you too you have to you no know, suffer it you have to suffer the stress that every other person is suffering so that you'll be able to put things right i think you know it's a very good one yes if all these people can see what the masses are you no know, if they can experience what the masses are experiencing at least for once somebody was like hmm, if somebody like the president can experience hardship just for one hour then it will have to put things right i don't know if anybody is supporting that notion and exactly what it is if they can suffer just one hour 
that they should go back to level of poverty just for one hour what the people have been facing i'm very sure this set of people would do the needful now you have seen it that oh for you to get to where you are going to it will take you a lot of time then the next thing you have to follow a uh, one way that we have all you know the rules and regulations have made it clear that nobody should you know fly one way and then you you are doing that so if you know the road is bad why can't you fix it fix the road so that at least every other person will enjoy that dividend that benefit but in a situation whereby you have been allowed to follow your one way every now and then you will not even think about others the next thing is oh, well, forget about those people i know my way and so but that's why a lot of people see complain about this same blt in lagos state yes yeah, so a lot of you no know, then every other vehicle will follow the traffic and the rest of it before you know it the same blt in the same state we have its own lane to boycott all those stress well that's the kind of country we have found ourselves right now i think a lot of people have given kudos to isaac fire on this one yes yeah, so let every other person do the same and then i think if there is cooperation where we have one voice in this country the country will be a better place yes either they like it or not they must hear us they must listen to us because the situation we are here you know we are not satisfied nobody is satisfied nobody is happy with what is going on in the country that's why we are of the opinion that everybody must come out and then speak the truth everybody must come out and they tell it the way it is yes we must not allow some you no know, group of people to escape this no we must all suffer it together i remember that word that somebody made clear that hmm she be now now vote for this government okay no while um, now nah, the suffering don't start all of us we go suffer um, together yes yeah, so they no go say she be now this uh, group of people vote for us mm, make we make for cheap for them no 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 now nah, everybody <laughs> go suffer um, together either you vote for the right party or not so better still let us do the needful so that in the end we will not regret and exactly what we are talking about yes yeah, so in the end we will not regret it because a lot of people already are regretting that hey if to say we know and i know mm, i wouldn't have voted for that party but look at now they have disappointed us and exactly what we are talking about they have disappointed the whole of you no know, nigerians and uh, that's so bad that's so bad well my brother my sister this is exactly what we are talking about on to this one what more can we say me well let me have your own take on this my people and remember to subscribe for more updates if you're just joining us on this channel for the first time all right thanks and god bless